Hello, it's John here. So I just want to show you guys how to wrap your hands. Lots of people lately have been asking me how to wrap their hands, okay, for, for your boxing, for your kickboxing. So the wraps that I have here, I'm not being biased. Well, I am, but we definitely have the best wraps. They're elasticated, okay, so that's what you want. So they're not too stiff. They actually have a little bit of spring in them. And they're five meters long as well, so you'll have like loads and loads to actually use up as well. You, you won't get to a certain point and run out of your wrap and go, oh no, I can't do it. So you take your loop end, you're going to take the stitch inside, and you're going to put that down okay you're going over the back of your hand to start it's always over the back of your hand it'll be more secure because if you go on the inside of your hand like this okay as you start to close your fist it starts to kind of peel away and loosen as you box so you don't want that so you're always going over the back of your hand so it's nice and secure okay so everyone will wrap their hands different but this is how i do it i go around the wrist at the start five times so one two three four and five now each time i'm doing that i'm giving it a little pull not too tight because with the elasticated ones they are they are stuck to you so not too tight but do definitely give them a little pull after i've done five on my wrist i'm going to go five over the knuckles so i go up here towards my baby finger and i go there's one two three four and five so there's five around the knuckles now i've actually left a little gap in between my fingers as i was doing these five because if you keep your fingers bet together and then wrap it around it'll be too tight and you won't be able to kind of go in between your fingers so you always keep a soft just little gap in between your fingers now so i've done five and i've done five i've come over the back of my hand at the start as well so now from here with the wrap i'm going to go to the bottom of my thumb and i'm going to go up and over into my baby finger boom that's the first one now you can push it down wiggle it in and then from here with the wrap i'm going to go on the inside of my hand so it's just getting bunched up so go on the inside of my hand and go over the knuckles and this has gone a bit there we go so once you loosen out over the knuckles bang and then back to the thumb and now i just repeat that for the next few for the next finger so i go over okay push it down and then on the inside boom and then over the knuckles again and then the last one hang on and the last one here go over boom then onto the inside of my hand over the knuckles one more time so you'll have plenty on the knuckles boom and then we're back to the starting point now we're going to go around the thumb okay so when i'm going over when i'm going over to the thumb I go over on the inside the same way as I did going down into the knuckles I go over and then I go around the whole thumb and then I bring it back over my hand and once I do that I'm going to go back into my thumb the other way so I go over my hand boom and now I'm going on the inside here so I'm going down that locks it in so the first one I went over over this way and now when I've gone around my hand I'm going back down okay once you've got to this point I'll go back over the hand once more time now I've done everything that I need to do and I still have some wrap left, so that's perfect. That's the advantages of getting the, the longer size. So now I'm just gonna go and finish the wrap. So I'll just go around my hand and get the last few little bits around the wrist. Okay, make sure that each one is nice and tight. So you're pulling them each time and then that's it. Now if you get to this point and uh, you feel like the, the Velcro is on the inside, you just give it a twist, just turn it around. You don't have to do the whole thing again. Just turn it around, bang, and close it. And then that's it. Yeah, so you've all your fingers done, you've plenty on your knuckles, plenty on your wrist, and it's nice and even as well, and that should be solid enough when you're boxing, so your, your hand isn't really going anywhere. That's it, so yeah, thanks.